the ticket, I'm packing up. I received the ticket, they asked me to pack up, I'm packing up. Right, right, right. And that's what we told them. They said, you're not even licensed. The city is No, but he was um, told if, I was told if I continue to play today, the possibility I'd be arrested, you know, so I'm um, packing up. I know you've been here for a long time. I've seen you here a long time. I played at this spot for over a year. Yeah. And, um, I think the tipping point was uh, when somebody uh, somebody said I was disturbing them, came and gave me money, trying to give me money to leave, and uh, I refused the money. And I think it pissed off the hotel. And from that point on, uh, the cops have been called. I've been public enemy number one. This is this is 10, 11 months in. This is a, a whole year in. I was the darling before. I was the darling. You know, everybody loved me, everybody talked good, but I don't tap dance, you know what I mean? I, I don't, I'm not a tap dancer, so as soon as I reclined money that was offered to me, you know what I mean? People uh, went on a smear campaign, you know what I mean? And that was, that's where we are right now, you know what I mean? After the smear campaign. Y'all know how I go. Okay. You know, things were very tense uh, in the atmosphere before uh, uh, before Kamala Harris got into the race. Things were very tense. You know what I mean? Uh, I was playing Dr. King. You know what I mean? To to try to get some sense of of morality in the era. Now you, know? you now you already got the citation. Yes. yes. Um, I just recently got a citation after being here for a year at this spot. So, um, you know, you could you could put that together, you know what I mean? Like, I was the darling before, you know what I mean? But since I booked somebody... Uh, what was the citation for? The citation is for soliciting in front of a restaurant area uh, after a year. 
I've been here since uh, summer of 23. So I'm packing up. Right now. Okay. See this too. Um, the chef has come out here wanting to fight me from the restaurant. The security guard has threatened to punch me in the face. Other musicians, have, everybody's bigger than me. You know what I mean? So, you know, it's, it just seemed like uh, I'm the little guy, but, you know, people appreciate me. You know what I mean? So, and, and I do well. You know, people appreciate it and they see me winning. So, uh, I, I think it makes people angry, you know. One more thing. Um, before the pandemic, I spent 10 years as an elementary school teacher here in Los Angeles in the inner city, you know what I mean? Uh, teaching elementary school. I have a website, icecreamsongs.com, which is devoted to educational music for children. Uh, Titles like the Itsy Bitsy Reggae Spider, Grooving Wheels on the Bus. Then for big kids, we got Multiplication Rap. Uh, nine times one equals nine. I woke up this morning and I'm feeling fine. Nine times two equals 18. I'm in and out of the shower and I'm feeling clean. Again, that's educational music for children at icecreamsongs.com. That's one word with an S. Okay, I'll put the link up. Thank you, sir. And your social media is? Uh, yeah, uh... Instagram is ice cream songs one on Instagram. One word with the S with the number one. And uh, for the people who appreciate me, um, the best you could do for me is to make your voice known, make your calls to the uh, Santa Monica City Council, uh, to the Shutters Hotel and the Coast Restaurant, if you appreciate the music, you know, and uh, express your appreciation, that's what can help. Ticket is for solicitation in front of a restaurant. Uh, this is the sign that I have up, uh, the Venmo and the Instagram uh, sign, bar, bar chain. And uh, I've been here for a year, and after a year's time, uh, I'm getting solicit. I'm getting the citation. <laughs> so you yeah. For a while, yeah, you know? that's all right. Yeah, okay. But you're, are you going to come back and play here I'm gonna be back to, I'm tomorrow? I'm going to communicate with the lieutenant that I had the conversation with earlier. I had a very positive conversation. And uh, he told me that there's a possibility that I was in a fraction of the ordinance. He was going to do his research. Uh, then uh, these officers came to give me a ticket. So uh, I'm going to communicate with him. I'm going to make the necessary changes. And, not put out a bucket or anything like that. Uh, my intention is to be here tomorrow. Um, uh, and, and 
another thing as I've had conflict with another musician and as an act of good faith, I've agreed not to show up on Wednesdays on his day off so he can play and uh, have his day. You know what I mean? Because I think that was a significant complaint because he came in through a tantrum two days straight. You know what I mean? And I think it caused the avalanche of complaints to the city. He came and started playing hard rock music. You know what I mean? Uh, and I'll send you a video of that that I sent to the sergeant, which is totally ridiculous. You know what I mean? But it was so it was so bad his behavior yesterday. You know what I mean? Then he wants to fight. You know what I mean? Like he's big. I'm a little guy. You know, I'm looking up at him like that. You know, but I'm, I'm not a coward. seems to be an intimidation game, you know what I mean? Because everybody who want to beat me up is bigger than me, you know what I mean? And they see me winning, they see me doing well, you know what I mean? So, what keeps coming to my mind is this, that Cain killed his brother Abel over envy and jealousy. That keeps coming to my mind, you know what I mean? Like, he, he killed his brother over envy and jealousy, you know what I mean? Like. I'm targeted, you know what I mean? It's like, uh, I got a target on me, you know so. Yeah, they, they yeah. bought me a ticket and they, you know. What a phenomenal me, waste of resources. They bought me a ticket and uh, told me if I keep playing this possibility, I'd be arrested. Oh you know what I mean? So. Why don't you go down there where all the homeless people are hanging out across from Big Deans and threatening people instead of a good guy who plays music? Man, you can have a conversation. I'm having a conversation right now. I'm dumbfounded no, that you're doing it. No, I'm not yelling. I'm speaking. Know, you want to hear me yell out oh, yeah. so yell? Yes, how do I yell? Yeah, whatever. You are far. You're far in politics, you're far in everything. What that mean? Go down there. Take care of business. If you, if you knew who I was, you wouldn't tell me that. I know who you are. So why would you? You know I'm always down there. I'm, how many times has Dean's called you or have I called? So if, Nobody shows up. I had one of your officers one day. Some no, guy but me. 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 And, yes. I'm always Go. down there. I've been over there for three and a half years fighting crime. I crowd. see you standing so why here would you say that? talking to the folks outside of the bike shop. That's what I see. Right. But this is so inappropriate. But so why would awful. You, why would you talk to me like that? Because I'm so, I'm so frustrated so with this city. So how do you city. think that I feel? As a police I officer no in the state of California, how do you think I feel? Well, then when I see six of you standing in front of the bike no, shop. Me. why? Yes, you. Right. You and maybe four or five other guys. How many times I've talked to somebody when people are harassing people? But you've never people? seen me do anything affected. No. Okay. Never. Okay. I think one time with a vendor down in the parking lot. Okay. Well, about four what, years ago. That's I don't know it. What, I don't know what to tell you. Then. What What you can say is the city needs to do better, taking care of what citizens, happened? not harassing a guy who's trying to make a guy. living. I'm so offended right now. You this is be. so inappropriate. I'm, I'm offended too. Good. And I hope you post this. And I hope we send it to the city. Have okay. you heard him perform? Yes, I walk here every single day. I hear him every day. He's beautiful. He doesn't harm anybody. Yet you have all the folks hanging out across from Big Dean's who have weapons, who are sitting out there yelling at people, who are walking around half dressed, who are like masturbating right out there. I see it every day because this is where I walk every day. It's absurd. It's offensive. And shame on this hotel if they call. Shame on them. I'm an event manager. I will tell all of my people never to do business here. I'll never eat here again. I am so offended. All this guy does is make music. I'm just, I'm just. The, the way you can help me yeah. is to direct your call to city council, and to shutters and to the restaurant. Oh yeah, shutters. You know I mean, I, I need, I need people to raise their voices. Yeah. You know oh, what I mean? Oh, for sure. And they tell your friends. Yeah, everybody. I'll take your picture if yeah, I can. Please. Yeah. And because, and I know everything. who you are because I follow you all the time. Well, thank you. And I, I'm shaking, I'm so upset. I wasn't even going to stop, and then I, I just... My name is Lionel. I'm shaking. My name is Lionel Jean-Baptiste. Wait, hang on, let me record. Go ahead. 
My name is Lionel Jean-Baptiste. I'm the musician that plays out in front of Shutters. I've been here for a year. Um, after a year's time, I've received the, the ticket after a year uh, of soliciting in front of the restaurant. At first, I started out as the darling. Everybody loved it. Then uh, I didn't accept money to leave. I guess it pissed somebody off, you know, and, and the smear campaign started. You know what I mean? Like, things were very tense before Kamala Harris got into the race. I'm an artist, I feel the tension. I was playing Dr. King over my speaker, you see what I mean, to try to instill some type of morality in the atmosphere. What's but, your um, name again? My name is Lionel Jean-Baptiste. Okay, Lionel. Um, and, and I'm going to cut it because I don't want it to be too long because people don't pay attention to long things. Thank you. I'm going to post it on my Threads account, I'm going to post it on Facebook. You send it to the police, I'm going to send it to Shutter's management. This is so offensive. You have to make the music. Okay, let everybody else My name is Lionel. What's your name? Harass people, Suzanne. Pleasure to meet you. Take care. I'm not treating you. I'm angry. But you're talking. Yes, I am. But, realize, but you came right at me and said, don't yell at me. No, no, no. no. Yeah, you did. No, no. Do you want dialogue? No, you didn't. And then you said, Over don't me. yell at me. I'm talking to him because I'm supporting him. Well, I'm going to reach out to this hotel because they are wrong. I'm an event manager. I bring business into this city. I live here. I'm done. They're going to go on my blacklist. But he's so quiet and gentle. I, then do they complain? Well, then what do you do about the guy who walks down here with his pants down with his dick and his But you have to realize they have bad policies. I, well, we have bad policy in the city. Well, I mean, in we, this city. But we go by state. Yeah, well, but you well, also go by the city. Yeah, but we don't arrest them. More people are arrested. We're two years. City years. But when you have bad policy, they collide with each other. Bad policy. Okay. I no get bail. it. But I, so I can tell I was you. Saying, it wasn't like this six years ago. Okay. So I'm it's all post COVID that, that hands off everywhere. I'm equally as frustrated. So okay. you're yeah. not the only person that this has happened to me before. So at a certain point, it just gets a little tiring for people to I yell at it. me too. I get I'm it. And like, it gets tiring for me when I feel like I'm walking. I drove down here today because I don't feel safe walking the mile home, going up Main by the liquor store there that I have to go up Bay when I get harassed. When down in front of Big Dean's, when down in front of the bathroom just passed on the bike path, I have been harassed by people. I had a woman come and attack me out there. We called the police, and never came. Another night I was at Dean's, it was a guy out there with a machete. They called, I sat there for an hour and a half. No police presence. So uh, what I but think they should do is have guys on bikes. And that's women a lot on of bikes times while we're actually standing here. You're saying we're standing here and that means you're having a camera. Can't be me present. Because everybody who knows Officer Hollowell knows that I don't just stand. I have seen you around. I am very There's vocal. There's two or cars that are out, out by there. the bike shops, right. by that parking lot. Stand there, talking. I've gone up, I approached one once, right. and I said, There's a guy over there with hot dog in the stick, screaming and choking. And he said, I'm writing a report. I said, No, you're not. You're standing here talking to your partner. If you want to do something, go over there and take care of that. And he said, Well, I'm writing a report right now. So I took out my phone and I recorded it. And then he went over there. I'm just offended. No, I think this is so wrong. But you understand that there are people that we that call us to do things that we may or may not agree with. But when there's I the complaint and then there is a little bit of a law, we have to at some point affect some of the law. But the, for me, is I've been doing this for a good amount of time, probably just as long as you've been coming out here from this area for, uh, uh, for a long time. But it doesn't have to be this way. No. But when well, we, what can when we, we do? compound, what can we do? So, when we we're, call we're, and nothing happens, but it's so the caution is have to be called because if we have one good one, no, 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 not because we have to call all the time. I'm saying we have no bad because people say they try to use equitable and that oh, it's equitable that we don't have bail. Well, sometimes people. I'm 100% agreement. And, yeah. agree and so now but I we're think so for... kind of No, no. This is. Can you can't stand over there and play. Can you move over there. I mean, he I, 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 just I'm needs sure. to be away from I, this pretentious smooth well, hotel. I, I, I've told him in the past. I said, if you would try to 
move yourself in a different position, you probably wouldn't get any complaints. Yeah. But when you're in a certain position, you're getting complaints. I'm not in charge of the complaints. He's been here for a year. So, and they, and I people have just touched that picture. He's not. He's an, and he's one of the nicer. And there's a guy. There's one of your officers who drives his car down on the bike path, and he's been great. I've stopped to him. I talked to him about a homeless couple that was living up there, elderly couple. He went and took care of them. I talked to him because I walk by. I say hi. Not me. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. No, you were down there, and you. Who's the other guy? The tall rapper, the officer. He's been. You know. Carlos. Yeah. Carlos? Am <laughs> I got the wrong guy? <laughs> yeah. He's a tall, bald guy, and I see, he's in, been in your videos. Yeah. I've seen him all the time. And well, he's very if You've seen his videos, then you've seen all of the stuff that we've had to do for the last year. Yeah. But the, I'm just dumb. So remember, we're the same. just dumb. We're, we're the same. Because when I call the police, the, and nothing happens. We're the same so people upset. that do a lot of this work. So when you're saying that, I'm saying, well, she's upset right now. But we have affected other problems, and it's just frustrating to be in this I, position yeah. I just would all like the to time. See a change. Not just you guys, but why aren't there officers like there used to be in the old days riding their bikes on the bike path or up in Palisades Park where I walk every other day? And that is accessible up by the cannon right there. I've written to the city, I've sent videos of pictures. I get to, we get, it's disgusting. We can have coffee, and I can tell you a multitude of reasons why things are not like they used to be. And I've been around for a little while, so I know where it, I, and I know where it started, and it probably didn't start with a police officer. There are some police officers that do what they do, I but I at the I end of the day, I've sent so many videos to the city. They, no, I would, they do I patrol. Prefer, they patrol so every day, yeah. but you know, you can always be there. Fifteen years ago in the mornings, I would walk. Always be an officer walking through in the morning, kind of rousing the folks, and he knew them. Like he'd say, "Hey, Mary, you know you can't smoke in here," and he would talk to them. Yeah. And I miss that. Yeah. I we still have that. officers doing that. And, and I would love for you to go to Rutland, so I can show you from my back. Yeah, I mean, what, I'm, what, I'm what, out here every day. No, but I want you to see. I want you yeah. to hear. I want you to see the calls on the screen. I want you to see the level of response of what of the other things that we're responding to in the beach. And maybe it will say, "Well, maybe that's why they don't come Now you can see screen you can see the radio calls you can see when, when we have to take a person to a mental hospital it's not in the city we've got to go outside of the city and then that may take a couple cars away and so just to get up just a, i'm not gonna i don't want to change your opinion no no i'm not i want to i just want to i just want to give you the lack the i want to give you pers the different uh perspective to me like i said when i walked by and went up to you i find this a profound waste of time for you guys that you get a call about a fellow playing music when there's so much but other shit going I on. I do realize this, we didn't come out in two days ago. This has been a year long thing that we have tried to affect, I've tried to talk to uh, Mr. Sean uh, Louise. I was just talking to Lino and I've been trying to say, hey, try to find another place because at a certain point, they're Which gonna is pull interesting the to me because I'll walk by here and I'll see people clapping for it. Right. I see well, a warm reception. But, but it doesn't show the guests who may, we may not see that call. And we have guests that call at night and call the police. They don't even call the hotel and say, can you go do something? And there's there's certain things that are protected. But he's not out here at night. There's no, no, no. But, then, here but then there's other people besides him. And then it gets conflated to be one person because he's here most of the time. So if you come play your saxophone here at night for a long, long time, one time, then yeah. it goes back to this guy when it may necessarily not be him. But if it's not him, this is a place that people travel to from all over the world. To not as much as they to, used to. No, I'm not you talking about how dead it is. How not, I'm not talking about hotels. Yeah. It's I mean, because people don't feel safe anymore, and that makes me so sad. Because I'm out here because I love it, and it just makes me feel so sad. So yeah, but it's also the city that can, there are things because I'm very well versed in government, and there are things that the city can do beyond what the state does. The state lays out one set. Each city can form their own regulations. Yeah. I just find it difficult to climb the uphill. I, I wish that we could well, all. I'm, I'm climbing it. No, no. You. I'll I'm send my videos no. to the city like I do all the I time. I wish that we could all work together. I wish the county and the city and the state could collaborate and work together for the greater good. 
because it's difficult to be in one city and trying to deal with all the people that come because they don't. It's a small city for the amount of people yeah. that traverse through the city, right? Yeah. So, I'm, I'm just, I would I, love. Yeah. No, I'm, I'm really, a, really, really serious about the ride along and. I've been on ride alongs up in where I grew up up in Redford. No, but I want to up there. I know. What I want to like. show you. I see it. I want to show you yeah. what we're dealing with. I see with the response. In, I see times when in, four cars pile up and there's an incident and it gets taken care of. But I've also seen it from my friends' experience who work in a restaurant who don't get a response because, well, it's your. You know, what are we going to do? It's big teams and everybody's drinking. Well, the folks that are out there that are sitting. Like one day, some woman came and grabbed a purse off the table, and I chased her down. Well, and we, I gave the well, police a description, nothing. I, and really, she was right down the way. I, I'm, I'm really good with the manager at Big Beans, and so she shares a lot of the Mary. Yeah, yeah, the experience. You ask her about Hollow, she has nothing but good things. Because yeah. I, literally, I and the people that I work with come and do. I do what I can in the situation. That well, I'll tell you this. When I walked up and saw this going on, my first reaction was at them, and it was. The, and what I said is, this is a profound waste of time for you. I just find it absurd. That's all. But and I, and they, I am. But it wasn't like an overnight. Oh, I get that. Picture. I get like that. It, I it, see it, this happen all yeah, the time. It's, it's, it's just been quite some time. Yeah. Uh, we have had supervisors come, we've had our management come, we've tried to dialogue and figure out if there are better ways to do it. And, you know, and well, I hope there is for him that he can find a spot. And uh, it, it's just, I just find it. Well, like I said, he's a nice guy. Yeah. It just happens to be a situation that well, we can't come to an agreement on how it should be handled. Yeah. To include but, him. To clarify, I was not yelling at you. I was speaking loudly because you were over there. I don't mind. I don't I, yell at police. I, I'm, a loud, I'm a loud talker. I just yeah. thought, like, uh, if no. come over here, we'll yeah. talk. And we'll I just do, wanted yeah. to give him some support while yeah. we were standing there. Was yeah, my no, I, and, and like, I, like I've discussed with him, he's a very educated guy. Mm -hmm. he's, he's, uh, I don't want to share his whole story, but he knows how to do lots of different things. Yeah. So this is a choice that yeah. It's up to him, and he has the lieutenant's business card. If he's going to uh, make a contact with him tomorrow. Uh, officer, we appreciate your your uh, service, and I, what I will do, I will reach out to the lieutenant because I seem to had a positive conversation with him earlier. Um, the condition was I was written a ticket today mm -hmm. after being here for a year. Okay. Um, so I'm going to reach out to the lieutenant. I'm leaving because I was threatened to be arrested if I continue to play. That's why I'm leaving. And what was the violation to be arrested? The violation after a year is soliciting for tips in front of a restaurant. This is after a year's time. Again, first I was the darling. Then I didn't accept some money. I reclined. And, and then the smear campaign began. Okay? I didn't tap dance to the tune of the establishment before the smear campaign began. You know, and y'all already know how that works. So um, I'm gonna peacefully get my things and move forward, communicate with the lieutenant, and my plan is to uh, continue making music. Okay, I thank you, I thank all of you very much. God bless, my name is Lionel Jean-Baptiste. Uh, you can find my music for children at icecreamsongs.com. I spent 10 years before the pandemic as an elementary school teacher, inner city schools in L.A. God bless you all. God right, bless you. Thank you so very much. Thanks for talking. No, thanks for talking. I'm glad he yeah. stayed, stayed